Hello, it's Rich with Black River Archery. Outside doing a little shooting today at South Cuyahoga Sportsman's Club in North Royalton. I had to come out here and do a little work on the indoor range where I teach youth archery in the wintertime to some, some of the kids on 10 Saturdays of winter. But uh, I was doing a little shooting and I noticed I had some serious damage to a fletch. And I get a lot of people telling me, you know, well, my fletch is damaged. I need you to refletch my arrows and... You know, my group's bad because my fletches are bent, all these things. So I've taken a couple shots and I'm pretty confident to walk down here and show you guys a pretty damaged fletch uh, and see if it's grouped with the rest of them. So we took a shot at 40 yards, three arrows, two are in good shape, and like I said, one has damage. We're going to walk down here and see. I'm pretty confident they're all going to be together. I've actually done this many times with an arrow that don't have any fletches on it. If your bow's in tune and you are shooting the right weighted arrows and white, right spined arrows for your poundage of your bow and your draw length, you don't even need fletches. So here we are. Pretty good looking group. See if we can find the bad fletched. There it is, right here. So this fletch is missing a section of the top. I don't know what happened to it. Maybe when I shot, you know what, when I shot that broadhead tune the other day making that video, I might have done that. Sliced off my sliced off my fletch with my broadhead. I bet you that's what happened. And it also, I'm trying to show you here, it has a hole where an arrow has punctured through the side of it for some reason, but, I mean, right here it is, laying with the rest of the arrows right there. Actually, personally, I think it's the best one in the rack. So, it's just a matter of getting out and shooting your bow, you know? People just don't shoot enough. You need to spend more time doing some practicing and if it's 10 yards or 20 yards, whatever it is, just to keep your form good and your muscle memory going and all that stuff. And then when you come outside and you've got a place like this to shoot, you know, 40, 50, 60 yards, the mechanics is all the same. There's no difference. It's right there. And I think I just showed that, you know, you can shoot a damaged arrow and still be pretty successful. Black River Archery, see you next time.